What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. I am the Ball Ginger. We're jumping back into some road to the show action here today. Got a three-game set with the Tampa Bay Rays in Tampa Bay. And they're doing pretty good on the season. We are not, so I'm only anticipating winning one of these three games. Hopefully I'm wrong on that. Top of the first here, two outs, nobody on. I'm standing in for the first time today, batting third in the order as is usual. Taj Bradley is the man on the mound for the Rays in this one. He's got a 97 mile an hour four seamer. Nothing else quick. First pitch from him. Oh, had me out in front of a curveball low and away. Swing and a miss there makes for an 0-1 count. <clears throat> Come on now, big guy. Give me a good one. Oh, another change up there below the knees. Swung on and missed. It's an 0-2 count in a hurry here. The two-strike pitch from Bradley. Oh, got me after a four-seamer up and in. Three pitches, three swings, three strikes. And back to the dugout we go. All right, coming back bottom half of the first here, Randy Rosarena. He's standing up, leading things off for the Tampa Bay Rays here. Nobody on, nobody out. One and two, the count for him here against starter Chad Madden. And Rosarena's hitting 296 on the season. Ground ball there up the middle. Late break for me, but uh, we'll get the ball to first in time. One away here to start things in the bottom half. Next batter is Wander Franco. He's hitting 303 on the season. He's 10th in the American League with that batting average. He's got a one and two count here against Chad Madden. Wind up and the pitch, and it's a ground ball right side. Come on. Oh, slow roller. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No, what the hell did it do? No way, dude. Are they going to hit me with an error for that? I hope not. Because that was, that was not cool. Four to nothing to score now. Bottom of the third. Tampa Bay has the lead. Jeter Downs is the man at the plate. He's one for one on the day. Nobody on, nobody out. One and two the count for him. And let's see what we get. Ground ball right side. And we'll pick that up. Throw to first. One away here in the bottom of the third. <clears throat> Couple batters later, we have Diego Infante. He's one for one on the day. Runner on first, two away for him here, and a 2-2 count in this at bat. Wind up and the pitch from left-handed Chad Madden. Come on, big guy. Rips one on the ground up the middle. Shortstop gets a glove on that. Throws to me at second for the force, and that ends the third inning. All right, top of the fourth now. I'm leading things off. 0 for 1 day with that strikeout in the first inning. Nobody on, nobody out. Here we go, Taj Bradley. Let's see what you got here with pitch number 36 of the game. Ah, swing and a miss at a curveball below the knees. What the heck? I'm swinging at everything. And nothing has been in the zone so far. Finally laying off one outside the zone. Four-seamer off the outside corner. And that runs the count to 1-1. One and one. Next pitch. Right down the middle of the four-seamer. Late swing. One and two the count. All right. Let's try to avoid that strikeout here. Yeah. Change up in the dirt there. Makes for a two and two count. Much better at bat so far than the first one. Off the outside corner with the curveball. Runs the count full. We're going to be looking at a payoff pitch here. I like it. I like it a lot. Come on, big fella. One good pitch. Four-seamer there, too close to the zone to not swing it. Got a piece, fouled it away. The count remains full. We're going to do the payoff pitch one more time here. Swing and a miss at a four-seamer in the zone. And I have struck out twice now in this game. Can't say that I'm a fan of that. Mason Auer is at the plate now here in the bottom of the fourth. Nobody out, nobody on. Full count for him in this at-bat. He's 0 for 1 so far in this one. Here's the windup and the pitch from Madden. It's a ground ball right at me. We're going to charge that a little bit. Throw to first will be in time. One away here in the bottom half of the fourth. Top of the sixth. It's a 5-0 ball game. Tampa Bay has extended their lead. I'm standing in 0-2 on the day with a pair of strikeouts. Taj Bradley still on the bump. Runner on first. One away. Let's see what I can do with this at bat. Four-seamer below the knees there. Taken for a ball. If he's going to keep throwing outside the zone, I'm going to have to start watching him. There's just nothing else I can do with that. The 1-0 pitch. Chop to third. That's going to be a double play. 5-4-3. You betcha. Not even a challenge there. And that ends the top of the sixth inning. 
All right, moving on. It's the top of the eighth. Nine to two the score now. Tampa Bay has extended their lead despite us scoring a couple of runs. And I'm standing in 0 for 3 on the day. Jorge Alcala is now on the mound in relief for the Rays. He has a 92 mile an hour slider, 100 miles an hour on the four seamer, 90 on the circle change, 97 on the slider, or sinker, sorry. And the first pitch is a four seamer in there. 0 and 1 the count after I watch that one go by. That comes in blisteringly quick, too. Another chopper to third on the slider on the outside corner. Throw to first is lazy and still beats me. And that is the second out here in the top of the eighth. Bottom half of the inning, it is now Brandon Lowe at the plate for the race. He's one for four on the day with a two-run dinger in the first inning. 0-1 the count for him here with a runner on first and nobody out. Tommy Mace is the man on the mound in relief for the Cardinals. Wind up and the pitch from him. And it's a ground ball to the left side. Shortstop gets a glove on that. Throw to me at second. Relay to first. Will be in time. And a 6-4-3 double play has erased the base runners and put two outs on the board. I like it. Rays take the win here in this one. 9-2 the final score. And we're going to move on to game number two. And you know what that means. That's where I remind everybody, if you haven't done so already, subscribe to the channel. If you're new here, subscribe to the channel. If you're old or new here, like and comment on the video. All of those things do help me out with the YouTube algorithm. Here we go. Top of the first. Two outs, nobody on. I'm batting third in the order. Still rocking an over on the series. Luis Patino is the man on the mound for the Rays in this one. He's got a 97 mile an hour four seamer, 96 on the sinker. Nothing else quick. First pitch from him. The four seamer above the zone, couldn't lay off it, swung on, got a piece, fouled it off. Oh, and won the count. All right, next pitch from him. Oh, swung on and missed with a slider on the outside corner at the knees. So, oh, and two the count. I was too far out in front of that one. The two-strike pitch. Got a piece of that four-seamer sent down the right field line and foul ground, but that gets down with no play made. Count remains 0-2 oh here. The next two-strike pitch from Patino. Chopper to third yet again. Throw across the diamond. It's going to get me. And that ends things here in the top of the first. We're moving on. Still no score. All right, bottom of the second. Tampa Bay's got on the board now. It's a 2 nothing ball game. Runners on the corner is only one away here for Randy Arena. He's 0 for 1 on the day. Got an 0-2 count in this at bat. And Michael McGreevy is on the mound for the Cardinals here. The pitch is a ground ball up the middle. We're going to flip the shortstop covering second. Bare hand grab and throw. He beats it out on the back end, though, so we only get the force at the second. Run does score, and by avoiding the double play, they're still alive here. Bottom of the third now. It's a 3-1 to one ball game. Tampa Bay in the lead. Wilson Contreras is at the plate for the Rays. He's one for one on the day. Has a 1-2 count with a runner on second and two away. Wind up and the pitch here from Michael McGreevy, and it's a ground ball to the right side. Slow roller through the infield grass. We're going to throw it first and get him. And that's going to end the third inning here. We're moving on to the fourth, trailing the Rays 3-1. to one. All right, top of the fourth. Runner on third and nobody out for me as I'm standing in for the second time today. 0 for 1 so far. Still rocking an 0 for on the series. Luis Patino still on the mound for the Rays. First pitch is a four-seamer on the outer third. Swung on and missed. 0 oh, and 1 the count. Next pitch from him. Ripped into center field. Holy cow. That's going to get caught, but it'll be enough. The runner from third can tag and score. So a sack fly there. Works for me. It's now a 3-2 ball game. Bottom of the fourth now. Runners on first and second. Wander Franco is the man on at the plate. He's two for two on the day with a pair of singles. Got a 2-2 count. Nobody out here. Let's go. Michael McGreevy kicks and deals. It's a ground ball to the left side. That should be a double play. Shortstop gets it, flips to me. Throw to first in time. It's a 6-4-3 double play. Takes two runners off the bases and puts two outs on the board in their place, but we do still have that runner at third. Four to two, the score now, top of the six. We come back to it. One out, nobody on for me. I am 0 for 1 with that sack fly earlier. Third plate appearance of the game against Luis Patino. First pitch of this at bat. There's a four-seamer blooped into shallow center field. Second baseman runs out to make the play in the outfield grass. And that is a wasted second out here in the top of the sixth. 
Bottom of the seventh, it's a five to three ball game. Bases are loaded, only one out for Randy Arozarena. He's one for four already in this one. Fifth plate appearance for him, holy cow. 0-1 pitch here from Andrew Abbott who come in out of the bullpen. That is weird. It's a ground ball to the right side. We're gonna throw to second, get the out there. Relay to first. Not gonna be in time, beats it out on the back end. Run scores, it is now a 6-3 ball game. Runners on the corners and two away here. <laughs> we move on here, Wander Franco at the plate. Three for four day for him with three singles and two runs scored. He's had a hell of a game. Runners on second and third now with two away. The one-two pitch on the way here from new reliever Tommy Mace. And that's a ground ball right to me at second. Slow roller though, we charge up on a throw to first. Will be in time and finally we get out of the bottom of the seventh and stop the bleeding. Top of the eighth now, six to three ball game, two outs, nobody on. I'm standing in 0 for two with the sack fly, still 0 for six on the series. Ryan Burr is the guy on the bump for the Rays in relief. He has a 97 mile an hour, four seamer, 90 on the cutter, 83 on the slider. First pitch from him. Ripped into deep center, left field, not center. Left fielder going out there towards the short wall. He's going to make the play on the warning track. Just a few feet shy of a home run there for me. And Tampa Bay wins game number two. Final score, eight to six. Wow, we put a couple of run, few runs up there on the top of the ninth, but not enough to tie it up. We're moving on to game number three. See if we can avoid the, getting swept on the road here. All right, here we go. Top of the first, runner on first and one away. I'm standing in, still rocking the over here. 261, the batting average for me coming into this one. Shane Boss is on the bump for the race. He's got a 98 mile an hour four seamer, 90 on the slider, 90 on his circle change as well. First pitch from him, inside with the four seamer, one and oh the count after watching that one go by. The Rays are leading the American League East on the season, so <laughs> I hope we win this one. Next pitch is a four seamer on the outer third, got a piece and fouled it away, late swing though. As the count moves to one and one. Next pitch from Boz here. Oh, four seamer above the zone. Thought it was a slower pitch. It was not. One and two the count after fouling that one away. I honestly don't even know how I got a piece of that one. I swung way too late. Low and away with a knuckle curve there. Evens up the count at two and two. Come on, big fella. Give me a good one to hit here. That's not it. Slider way outside. Moves the count full here. Three and two. Payoff pitch is going to be on the way here from Shane Boz. And he got me to swing at a slider just off the outside corner. And that strikeout is, what, my third or fourth of the series now? Not a pretty day at the plate here in this one. One to nothing to score here in the bottom of the second. We come back to it. Two outs and nobody on for Diego Infante. He's hitting 350 on the season. Has a two and one count here against starter Jackson Job. Job kicks and deals, and he bunts one down the first base line. That's going to be snagged up by the first baseman. He takes it to the bag himself. So three unassisted is how you're going to score that one. bunt. All right, bottom of the third. We're coming back to it. Gavin Collins at the plate. He's hitting 211 on the season, batting ninth in the order today. Nobody out, nobody on. 2-2 two, two count for him here. <clears throat> and Jackson Joe with the 2-2 two, two pitch. It's a ground ball up the middle. We'll get a glove on that. Throw to first will be in time. And that is the first out here in the bottom of the third. Top of the fourth, we come back to it. Still a 1-0 ball game. I'm standing in 0 for 1 on the day, 0 for 8 on the series. But I do have an RBI to show for it with that sack fly in the second game of this series. One out, nobody on for me. Shane Boz still towing the rubber for the Rays. First pitch is way inside with that four-seamer. 1-0 and the count after watching that one go by. Somehow I've got 72 RBIs, and that is fourth in the National League this year. That is weird. Late swing on a four-seamer right down Broadway. And that's fouled away. One and one the count. Little souvenir for the folks down the right field line there. The 1-1 one, one pitch from Shane Boz. There's a four-seamer on the outer corner. Popped up. Catcher's going to make the play there just in front of the home plate. And that's a very much wasted second out here in the top of the fourth. Top of the sixth, we come back to it. Runners on the corners and two away. Shane Boz is still on the mound, and I'm going to get a boss battle challenge against him. 
Uh, we got to try to drive in that run. That's all we got, really, right? Tying up the game would be amazing here, but it's going to take a base hit. First pitch of the at-bat from Boz is inside with that four-seamer. 1-0 the count. I'm hitting 331 on the season with runners in scoring position. I don't know how. I don't seem to be doing too good lately. Oh, swing and a miss at a knuckle curve just off the inside corner there with pitch number two. Evens up the count at 1-1. One and one. Third pitch of the at-bat now from Boz. Low and inside with a knuckle curve. 2-1 and one the count after watching that one go by. Come on, big fella. One good pitch, that's all I need. Nope. Just off the outside corner with a four-seamer there. That may, runs the count to three and one. Are we gonna get the bases loaded here? We are. Four-seamer off the outside corner. And it's a five-pitch walk for me. I get first base for free here. It's not a base hit, doesn't drive in a run, but at least it was something, right? Bottom of the sixth, we come back to it. Nobody out, nobody on for Randy or Rosarena. He's one for two on the day so far. Has a 1-1 one -one count here in this at bat against Jackson Job. And the right-hander kicks and deals. And it's a ground ball to the right side. Slow roller, and he's quick down the base path, but we get him at first, and that is the first out here in the bottom of the sixth. All right, JT again on the mound now in the bottom of the eighth. The runners on second and third, and Wander Franco standing up to the dish. One for three day for him. Nobody out so far. 0-1 oh, pitch here from JT Ginn. We're playing in shallow, expecting the bunt. And it's a pop-up. You got to be kidding me. So I will catch that one. I'm going to throw it a home plate just for grins and giggles. Not like the guy's going to try to tag and run there. But thankfully, an uneventless first out here in the bottom of the eighth. Four to nothing to score now. We come back top of the ninth. I'm leading things off. Nobody out, nobody on. 0 for 2 day for me. 0 for 9 on the series. We got to get rid of that 0 for, man. Josh Fleming is on the mound in relief for the Rays, trying to close things out here. He's got a 93-mile-an-hour sinker. Nothing else quick. First pitch from that lefty. Ripped into right center field. That's going to get down for a base hit. And we're going to go to for 2. Why not? And we're in there safely. How about that? Stretched out the double there. That was a lot closer than I thought it was going to be. So, either way, it is a double. I'll take it anytime I can get it. And the Rays sweep us here in Tampa Bay. Final score four to one here in game number three. So, you know, at least I did get that double. And I did score the only run. So, they did manage to drive me in after that extra base hit to lead things off. But, you know, a little too little, a little too late. What can you do? That's baseball for you. And that's going to be the end of the series. Also, the end of the episode for those of you still hanging out with me. Thanks for being here. I really appreciate it. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and do all the fun social media things. And we will see you in the next one.